why y'all like this so much. This literally has like 5%. Who really comes on camera looking like this? <laughs> I think my heel is just permanently crusty. <laughs> Where every time I come on the vlog, I look crazy. <laughs> hey y'all, welcome back to another vlog. But not just any vlog. We back with a vlogmas. What is this? Technically, y'all, this is the official vlogmas vlog because today is December first. The videos y'all have been seeing before this video was already recorded, but. I was about to drop them before December. Like I was about to drop them like two days before December. I had three videos recorded, which y'all saw already by now. <laughs> if you have not, then go watch the videos because why is you here and you ain't even watched them yet. Come on now, go in order. Don't be trying to skip the line. So those videos, I was literally about to drop one on November 28th and then one probably in December. But I was like, yo, I'm tripping because Vlogmas is coming up. I got to save these videos. like. I feel like personally, it don't really matter that they're pre-recorded as long as I post every day until December 25th. And also, obviously y'all, I just came from underneath the hair dryer. Uh, that's why I look like this. But anyway, also I wanna point out that throughout this one to 25 days, it's not gonna be all vlogs. Some of them are gonna be like content videos because I wanna do like some fun stuff like trying Starbucks holiday drinks, making my own Christmas cookies, doing a gingerbread house. Like I wanna do different kinds of stuff because <laughs> it's Christmas time, it's Christmas time. So I do wanna do different stuff. But today, today's vlog, baby, we gotta clean up and get this Y'all, I ain't even gonna show y'all what everything looked like in front of me because I've been busy with work trying to edit the videos that I told y'all about already. So today is more so like a Sunday reset or a self-care vlog, whatever you want to call it. Um, I know when I when I tired it, but before we start cleaning and doing like some self-care, because I need to do a mask, I want to do a foot mask, I want to pour some wine, I want to smoke some hookah. Okay, and I need to unpack my damn suitcase from when I went on vacation. But before we do that, y'all, we gotta go to Walmart. And I'm not um, curling my hair until tomorrow because I'm going outside tomorrow. And I know when I'm about to clean up right now, a bitch about to be sweating. Let's go to Walmart real quick, y'all. I'm gonna show y'all when I get back. I'm gonna take y'all with me, but I'm gonna show y'all when I get back what I got because TikTok made me buy it. That <laughs> lamb on my new bitch, I ride like my goat. I ride around my city with my head, trying to find so good. He didn't want me, did what I gotta make it back home. <laughs> hey, y'all, I know my neighbors be sick of me, but I don't give a fuck because I pay rent. The fuck? Anyway, y'all, I'm gonna put this jacket on because obviously I told y'all. My hair is looking like this, so what we gonna do is, mind your business. Oh, girl, how you know I got my hair right up? I don't know. And we go to Walmart anyway, Walmart ghetto. I'm sorry, Walmart is ghetto. And I'm ghetto, but Walmart is ghetto. Now I went there going to Target looking like this. But Walmart, we can do this. <laughs> we gonna throw our glasses on, make us look studious. And I gotta grab some water, y'all. So water, wine, and the candle that I'm, I told you about. I'm out of breath, all that rapping, god damn. I don't know how the rappers do it. Let's go. Y'all, let me tell y'all something so funny. When I was editing the vlog, <laughs> please go watch the Vegas vlog, y'all, because when I tell you, me and my family act just alike, we are all crazy as hell, like, and dramatic as hell. I was laughing because when I was editing the vlog for Vegas, I kept singing in so many clips and I didn't even realize that I was fucking singing when I was recording. <laughs> I sung Whitney Houston like three times in the fucking vlog. Like, what's going on? And then when we went to go see the lights, I'm laughing because all you hear is, ooh, ah, ooh. We went to go watch the water show. That's all you heard was, ooh, ah, ooh, look at the lights. Just being dramatic, y'all. That was me and my aunt and my grandma. Y'all want to hear something so crazy I just thought about? Why is it that only Vlogmas time 
creators, well, some creators out do it outside of Vlogmas, but I'm gonna give, I'm gonna use myself an example. Why is it that I can find myself going hard or having motivation to post every day for Vlogmas? First of all, Vlogmas for people who still have a job, I know that that is very hard, especially for myself. Trying to toggle a nine to five, eight hours of the day, that's already mentally draining, depending on what you do too, but that's draining. And then on top of that, editing your own videos, posting your own videos, promoting your own videos, creating, like it's a lot, it's a lot. But it's like the fact that I push myself, or at this time, I'm gonna push myself to do the whole 25 days. The fact that I'm able to do that with a job why can't i be consistent outside of vlogmas it's like i like the pressure of vlogmas but it's like i should keep that same pressure for the whole year you know what i mean like just as hard as i want to make sure i get the videos out for vlogmas it's the same way i should make sure i get the videos out when it's not vlogmas do you get what i'm trying to say but I think, it's, I think it's the challenge for me. But I need to always challenge myself because imagine me posting, not every day, but imagine me posting as frequent or being on top of shit as, cause I know y'all be noticing, I post a video sometimes, go away for two weeks, post a video. Like I'm very inconsistent and I know that's why my YouTube channel has not grown at the way that I believe that it should, but I'm not worried about that because the time will come. But I have to do something different in 2023. Y'all, what the fuck? Why is he? Like, what's up, bro? If I can post a fucking vlog every single day, like, what? Bitch, who do you think you are? <laughs> Why did I come outside looking like this? <laughs> Even though I'm going to Walmart, it is still embarrassing. How dare me? The good thing is that I don't know nobody here, so. <laughs> I ain't got to worry about running into somebody. This is gonna be in and out. We are in the wine section. Y'all, this is the favorite part of the store. <laughs> Especially for us ladies. You know, ladies love to drink wine. I'm looking for, I'm looking for a yellow bone long hair star. Nah, for real, for real. I'm looking for Sutter Home Sweet Red. Before I show y'all what I get, cause I don't drink this shit. I don't understand why y'all like this so much. This literally has like 5%, like 5%. Y'all paying $10 for 5%. Hold on y'all, let me let me put y'all on real quick. Let me show y'all. This is semi, look at that y'all. Y'all think I'm playing 5%? What the hell is you even wasting your calories for, for 5%? You gonna have to damn near drink the whole bottle to get drunk. <laughs> uh uh, we gonna put that right there, Stella. Now this is what you need in your life. You get ten dollars for this big one, and let me tell y'all what the percentage is on this. Just in case, you know what I'm saying? Putting y'all on like I always do. I think it's thirteen. So this percentage is twelve point five, y'all. You getting the same good taste? I feel like I'm giving them a promo, right? The fuck? They ain't pay me for this. You get the same taste, y'all, for the same price. But at least you won't get drunk if you drink one or two glasses and not the whole bottle. So this is what we gonna get. I swear to goodness, I just seen Method Man. I know I just seen Method Man. <laughs> I'm not even playing. I'm about to go see if I can find him. I know that wasn't really him, but this man looked just like Method Man. Ooh, should I get some cinnamon rolls while I'm in here? Mine as well. Now, this is my cart. Should I take it? I think I am, cause I'm not buying that stuff, but I think I'm gonna take this cart. I'm gonna just show y'all the, the cinnamon rolls that y'all need to get. Don't get no other one, except the ones I'm about to show y'all. That's if they have them. Here they go right here. Cinnamon roll flaky, baby. But I think I want the big ones. So I usually get the big ones, but I don't see the big ones for any flaky. Let me keep looking, if not, I'm gonna just grab one of these just in case. These the ones that you do not wanna get. The ones that say air fryer ready, these are nasty. Okay, don't get these y'all. But they don't have the big ones in the flaky, so I'm gonna just stick to the ones that I got. 
So this is the candle section, right? I'm gonna do a little quiz on y'all real quick so I can see if y'all gonna guess the one that I actually got. So is either out of this one, do you think I got this one? Comment below what you think. Do you think I got this one? Do you think I got this one? Or do you think I got this one, y'all? Let me know, I'm gonna let y'all know by the time I get home, but I found out which one to get from off of TikTok. Thank God, y'all, for my windows being tinted because I had to take that hood off, baby. This is exactly why I ain't curl my hair yet because it's already sweating. So I'm back at the house, y'all. Until I'm done cleaning and doing everything I need to do, I am just going to put this little thing on my head. Hopefully, it don't make my hair sweat even more. Drum roll, please. Y'all, this is the candle that I got. It's so cute. Crazy thing is, y'all, I'm gonna be getting more candles really soon from Bath & Body Works on one of these vlogs because I think candle day is either, I know it's tonight for exclusive members such as myself, but I wanna actually go in store. It's only online tonight at eight o'clock uh, as an early access, but I wanna go in the store, so I'm gonna have a vlog just for that, you know, to go candle day shopping or in candle day at Meth and Body Works. But in the meantime, y'all, so basically this candle, the hype behind this candle is that if y'all know the fragrance Baccarat, first of all, it is extremely expensive to me. It's like $300, $400. It is a cologne perfume. I think perfume, cologne. It's unisex, either way. But if you know, you know Baccarat smells chef kisses. So I was on TikTok and you know scrolling doing my one two one two and this girl that she had a 12 ounce one which is completely sold out in the store and online. She said that this candle smelled like the Baccarat perfume. So I'm like, okay, let's try it out. Fuck it. So we got it. They say you're supposed to light it like this if you got a little short one, right? Like upside down, right? Ooh, so you don't burn your finger. Ain't that what they said to do? Dang, maybe that wasn't the smartest idea. Ooh, it's my birthday. Make a wish. <laughs> nah, y'all, I'm about to sit this down somewhere and then I guess I'll give y'all an update once it start burning. We're gonna leave it right there, y'all, on top of the fridge. And then I got some wine I told y'all about already. If you don't drink this wine, try it out. Let me know what you think. We are actually gonna pour us a glass before we start cleaning and stuff because I need some motivation. <laughs> That's my excuse. I need some motivation. Also, I did stop at the hookah store. So this is the little piece, y'all. If you watch my vlogs, then you know. Because last time I tried to smoke hookah at home, I didn't have this little piece right here. This is the piece that I was talking about that the hose goes down inside of. So baby, we smoking hookah tonight, okay? This is a self-care day, so <laughs> hookah is a part of it. And then I got some watermelon mint and some more coals. So the first thing y'all that I need to do is pour a glass of wine and then we are gonna tackle unpacking my suitcase. I don't know why it seemed like I never really come in my room on the camera. Maybe because it ain't all the way done. So my suitcase, y'all, look crazy. This is my suitcase. I've been digging back and forth in it. Right now, I'm about to turn on Raven's new video. Raven, I was talking about her in my one of my vlogs, y'all, um, from Love Island Season 3. I love Raven. Ah! So she just dropped a Q&A video which is different. She dropped Pilates um, videos on her YouTube, but I don't watch that for real. So this is the first time that she actually posted like a regular, we're gonna do regular kind of video, so. Oh my goodness, this is exactly why I ain't wanna pack this shit. 
unpack this shit. What was the casting process like? Okay, the casting process was very interesting. And then every single day after oh, that, wow. another person would call me. So then it got like a lot deeper into it. And I was like, this is gonna get a lot more serious. Oh, I know she happy as hell she went on that show. Even though things didn't work out the way that she wanted it to, it's like she still got <laughs> benefits from it, such as Working with brands and creating, building her YouTube channel even more. Like, you just never know. She's so dramatic. <laughs> I love it. Oh, I got so much stuff. And this box is so cute. So this is all my hair stuff, y'all, that I left on the counter that I have to put down. And this drawer, which is my hair drawer, even though I don't have that much hair, yes, I do still have a hair drawer, y'all. <laughs> uh, so I put everything away. I cleaned up. I um, did my suitcase and my book bag. So I'm going to get in the shower real quick. And then after I get out of the shower is when we're going to do the face mask and the foot mask. And then we're going to set up that hookah. That's my favorite part. That's my favorite part. And I'm a little lit, y'all. Oh, that one glass. I ain't even done the first glass, but baby, we pouring up us another glass when it's time to smoke that hookah, girl. And then we gonna end the night there. So let me get in the shower real quick and wash that ass. Make me feel these days. Smoke a nigga top for you, baby girl. I gotta keep fixing my damn. I got on like a little onesie, you know what I'm saying? With the little booty cheeks out. <laughs> Girl, I ain't gonna show y'all that, but I got that on. But the, you know, the booby part keep like moving and it kind of like time to back. I'm gonna show y'all that much. That's all y'all can see. That's all y'all can see. That's it. That's it. So I wanted to show y'all the fragrance that oh, obviously I like to use when I got the shower. Y'all, it is only a little bit left. This is Ambery Vanilla by Dossier. I love this fragrance so much, y'all. Oh, it just smells so refreshing. You know what I'm saying? Smelling real good. You would think I had a man. And and then, y'all, I told y'all about this body oil. I got another one. Oh, no. I used it all. I didn't know I used it all. But anyway, this body oil right here, y'all, A1. And all you need to do is pump it on your hand. I was laughing because I was looking at the footage earlier when I was showing y'all the cinnamon rolls. And my hands was ashy as hell. Y'all ain't even tell me. <laughs> my hands was so ashy, y'all. Like the little crack pot right there. I always miss that spot. <laughs> anyway, I already oiled the rest of my body, but I wanted to show y'all. Um, you know what I'm saying? The oil, just in case you're new here. <laughs> and then what we're gonna do is put this face mask on. This is the Teamy Detox Mask. This is what we're going to do. And I got this foot mask. I don't know if y'all saw when I was at TJ Maxx the other day. One of them vlogs ago, y'all. Probably the first vlog of the Vlogmas. I don't know. This is the foot mask that I got. Boom! Okay. A matter of fact, I got this when I did the Prep For Me Vacation Haul video. Something like that. So we're going to do this foot mask. I used one already. But I couldn't really tell the difference, honestly. I think my heel is just permanently crusty. <laughs> I swear, y'all. And I don't get the cheese grater because Keita told me don't get the, che the cheese grater no more at the nail shop because that make it thicker. But I feel like after years of getting a damn cheese grater on my feet, it fucked my feet up, y'all. So now it's like I just use the pumice bar in the shower. And then I put aquaphor on my feet. Not every night, but I try to do every night. And they put socks on. And they still crusty. So if y'all got like some foot remedies to get the crust, you know, the, the calluses off your feet, please holla at your girl. Can I get a refill? Can I get a refill? Yeah. <laughs> I do a very... Thin layer, y'all. You don't need a lot at all. And you just put it all over your face for 10 to 15 minutes. Teamy, if you watching this, <laughs> sponsor your girl because 
yeah i love this product only thing about it though which is not nothing against the product but it is a detox mask so you are going to probably have breakouts after this because it's like bringing it all to the forefront like detoxifying your skin seriously though like <laughs> so i like to put it all over so we're gonna let this sit for a little bit i'm trying to think should i put my you know what i'm gonna set the hookah up while it's sitting on my face and then i'm not gonna like start it all the way but by the time i'm done setting the hookah up it should be time to wash this off and then girl we can do the foot mask you know so i see y'all in the kitchen be gone, but I <laughs> hey yo one thing about me y'all i'm gonna come on camera looking crazy like who really comes on camera looking like this Anyway, let's clean the hookah, which is not gonna take that long. And then I'm gonna come back on camera when it's time to actually like set it up. I can't even take myself seriously with this damn shit on my face. But anyway, I'm gonna be back in like five minutes. Give me like five minutes the same. So the hookah is clean, y'all. Nice and clean. And then we put this on there like that. I like to do ice at the bottom, y'all, because it helps it smoke like better so if you are not of age please do not smoke okay and if you are judgmental on me smoking hookah then judge your mama okay these little things right here y'all i love these because these are already pre like poked so you don't have to actually poke holes in them so i am going to take this off and sit it on the stove until i'm done with my face mask and my foot mask because i don't want it to burn when it goes up there face mask y'all you literally just washing it off that's it so give me like two seconds now i'm gonna just put some toner on my face y'all i don't do nothing else at night but just put toner on um i don't do moisturizer at night so i kind of use too much and i use the fenty fat water i think i showed y'all before but whoo y'all when i tell you my face feel so good and so buttersome. Y'all gotta try that Teamy Detox Mask. It make your skin feel so good. Ah! All right, let's get these crusty ass feet done. And then we can smoke our hookah and pour us up another glass of wine. Cause your girl is tired. So this is the foot mask, y'all. It is a tea tree and mint. It says it's purifying foot mask treatment socks infused to help heal feet and repair skin hopefully the more that i do these the more my skin get better on my foot but it says that you're supposed to wash and dry your feet thoroughly which i've already done do not use on wet feet open foot mask pack it and place over foot like a sock massage moisturizer into feet leave on to th for 30 to 20 to 30 minutes remove mask and massage remaining massage bitch i can't read massage remaining moisturizer into feet do not rinse the feet oh i rinsed my feet last time so you support this is why you're supposed to read directions because last time i did this y'all i did not read <laughs> all right let's put these on y'all and i got some long socks to put over top of it for since they're gonna be on for like 20 to 30 minutes i'm gonna go and smoke my hookah and chill and then i get y'all update one shoe at a time y'all they literally look like shoes ah they look like little shoes look at it girl look like a whole boot <laughs> so it says to put your feet in here like this Ew, it feels so crazy. So you want to massage it, they say. And then what I'm going to do is put my sock on top like this so that it can stay on. Boom! Hopefully, y'all, this really worked after doing this for like maybe a month. Massage it, they say. And then we're going to put the other sock on. All right, so now we're just going to put a timer on the phone. We're going to keep these on for 30 minutes. It say 20 to 30, but, bitch, we need 30 because my feet is crusty. So we'll we, we see what they look like and what they feel like in 30 minutes. Ah, I got my piece. 
Oh yeah, we back in action, baby. I wouldn't do no partner hey, you either. Shit up. Hell no. Nah. <laughs> you coming and cause the uproar of my shit now. You know what I'm saying? Uh, if I'm already doing good, if I needed a partner, that'd be different. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. It don't make no sense. Well, I'm taking off the little sock thing. So they say to keep the moisturizer, I mean, to keep the stuff on there. So I'm going to just take it off, y'all. Let me see how my feet feel. It feels soft. I had it on there definitely over 30 minutes though, for sure. And then I'm gonna just keep my socks on since I'm not supposed to rinse my feet. And hopefully when I wake up in the morning, my feet is extra soft. We gonna see y'all. We gonna see, I give y'all update. Oh, FYI y'all, that candle, 10 out of 10. Recommend y'all. If y'all can find that candle, is Better Homes and Gardens, which is Walmart brand, but it's amber and Sephiron, Sephiron, however you pronounce it, y'all. But if you can find it, get it, y'all. Get it. So I definitely recommend it. It smells so fucking good. Um, I'm gonna make sure I'm gonna have to burn it. I'm gonna have to make sure to blow it out before I go to bed, though, because sometimes I be leaving my candles on all night, y'all. So yeah. Uh this is a interesting self-care kind of vlog in a way, kind of chill, relaxing. I'm gonna lay down and call it a night. Your girl is tired, so. So I will definitely check in with y'all with the next vlog. I'm excited, y'all. I love vlogging, I told y'all that. But tomorrow, I'm even thinking about, now that I got everything clean and put up, I might go shopping. No, you know what? I am gonna go shopping for Christmas tree and decorations and stuff. Even though your girl ain't got no furniture yet, I still wanted to feel Christmas and festive like in here, so. Next vlog, we're going to do the Christmas shopping. And then we got so many other vlogs to do other stuff. Candle Day going to be in one of the vlogs. Y'all, I just got, I ain't going to tell too much. I ain't going to tell too much. Just stay tuned. If you're not subscribed already, go ahead and subscribe. And if you like the video, give me a thumbs up. If you do not like the video, give me a thumbs up. I appreciate y'all for clicking on that video. Okay, tomorrow is the weekend, so your girl is going to be outside. You already know, so i see y'all on my next vlog. Peace.